Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, if you're new, welcome to the channel. We're going to be doing a AC belt tensioner pulley. Uh, not pulley, but ten tensioner replacement today. There's a new one. You can see it. Mine's making a real loud, real, 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 real loud screeching noise. Like, like really loud. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, if you can see anything. What? If you can see anything. I'm trying to get the line out right here. Yeah. Okay. Okay, baby. Fix this over here so you can see it. Okay. Okay. Right there. But there it is. Uh. Can I go here? This, this, sit right there, baby. Uh, there it is. I'm going to attempt to take this off without taking the main serpentine belt off. I think I can do it. I think I can do it. The only way, the only reason you'd want to take the main serpentine belt off, I think, would be to change this belt. But I'm not going to do that. So I think I can just loosen this up enough to get this belt off and out of the way, so I can take this off. But uh, we'll see how it goes. Uh, I wish I could leave the light somewhere that you can see. Maybe I can right here. Well, Dad, maybe. I can see. Okay. Dad, don't walk behind me. Go ahead and have a bag. Oh, can you see it or not? I don't know. Okay. You're gonna need a uh, three eighths to do this pulley. It's a three eighths drive ratchet. That's all you're gonna need. If your truck has the mud, the the yeah. plastic mud guard right here. That will help. Take it off. I don't have it on. On there, so I, I took it off a long time ago. It's okay. gonna be a 15 millimeter. Uh. Go ahead and get this off. Uh, probably going the wrong way, honestly. Uh, she's out. Good to go. And well, you don't want to set it down too hard, but just give it a little, uh, a little snug, uh, a little snug, a little snuggly snug. We don't, we don't torque the spec around here. That's too much work. You can hand tighten this one until it gets. Well, you can't hand tighten it no more. If it's not, you're gonna you're gonna be here a while. Cause you're gonna only move this ranch so much nope. in this little area. Nope. Get the extension out. You don't have to use the extension, but I do. Uh. Put your belt back on the loop and just stuff. Make sure it's all in the grooves, all good and everything. Come on, baby. Okay. Tight as it is. What? You know what go fit here? I think it's on. Let's see. Okay. Check it. Make sure. Go Everything's here. good. Go. 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 Make sure it's. Okay. Let's see. Okay. I think that's good. Probably the easiest fix you'll ever do on your truck, motor wise. Because you do not have to take that serpentine belt off, which saves you a lot of time. I'll get you a better view here in a minute and get this camera. Okay. So, this is what you're working with. Here it is. AC belt. Let me clean this freaking lens off first. So sorry. Yeah. What? Okay. 
looks a little better. Okay. Here it is. There's your tensioner right there. You got that bolt under it, and there's another bolt. Well, it's back there um, below it somewhere. But uh, all you gotta do is take that belt off. You don't have to touch your serpentine belt. Yes, I'm laying on the ground. Whatever. Uh, and then of course, start it. Fire it up, man. Hang on, just a second. Yep, there we go. Uh, just start it. Make sure everything, uh, make sure it's not making the mind it. Make the noise all, all the time, but when it made the noise, oh, you heard it. It made the noise. Uh, let me get this box here so you can always get a part number. Oh, here you go. You can see that. Here's your part number. AC belt tensioner. It cost me about $38 after taxes and stuff. But, uh, uh yeah. That's AC belt tensioner. That's what it's called. This is on an 05 Silverado 5.3 V8 Vortec. Uh, if you found this video any little bit <coughs> helpful, subscribe to this channel. Help me out, like, uh, comment, whatever you gotta do. Uh, like I said, just you, if you this video, you felt this video any little bit helpful, be sure to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, drop a comment down below. Uh, but until next time, I will catch y'all on the flip side. Peace.